Cleveland Medical Institute has some amazing programs to make sure their students are successful in their medical field. I talked with Vandra Fleet about how they help students with finding jobs. Good morning, Vandra. How are you doing? I'm doing really well. Thank you so much. How are you? Good. I'm, I'm doing very good. Let's talk about your role at Pima Medical Institute and what you do. So I am the Corporate Career Services Manager at Pima Medical Institute, and my role is to provide support to all of our career services departments at each one of our campuses. What career services does, in essence, is assisting students with their professional development while they're in class. We also build relationships with allied health employers in our communities. We place students out at externship for the externship portion of their program. And then our shared main goal with most of our students, if not all, is to assist with employment once they're finished with their program. So all right, how does that work with you helping the students with finding uh, jobs in their field? So our main goal is to really play matchmaker when it comes to the externship. That way the employer gets to basically interview that student for up to six weeks of externship. So you, they have about a 200, between 160 to 200 hours of clinical as a proving ground uh, so that they can get their foot in the door and get hired. Typically about half of our students get hired from the externship and then the remaining half of our students, we work really closely with them to find uh, uh, job leads for them, assist them with the application process. We even go as far as working with them in mock interviews, basically whatever they need to secure that position. So, all right, what are some tips that you can give us on doing the applications and and getting ready for uh, meeting those career job interviews? So, I think right now a lot of things have shifted to this online atmosphere. So, a really great tip is to really beef up your online presence. So, and that goes for not just you know, allied health professionals, but anybody that's looking for a job right now. Um, Networking via social media, using platforms like LinkedIn to network with people in your chosen career field, uh, making sure that you have a really solid resume. I have a lot of students who we work with to create um, digital portfolios as well, so they can showcase all of their, you know, past work experience and couple that with their education. Anything that's going to make you attractive to an employer, especially if you don't have that face to face or you're not necessarily walking into different uh, facilities, is absolutely critical to securing that position right now. So, wow, and and this is great because it's offered to your students, uh, which is very important. I know that they're starting to uh, go online to start doing classes and stuff, and so this is another way that they can, again, further their careers is through your program. Absolutely. So, yeah. Thank you, Bill. I'll tell you, this is awesome. Thank you very much for joining us. And again, um, people know that uh, online classes have started, as I said, and careers in the medical field are definitely needed right now. Absolutely, and we love that so many of our students are getting this really, really valuable experience, even though it happened through a pandemic. All of the things are just really enhancing and putting a spotlight on what Pima Medical Institute does well and what our students and graduates do really well. So um, we're this is an exciting time. So perfect. Well, thank you very much for joining us this morning. All right. Thank you so much. You have a great day. Thank you.